Some people see things as they are and say, why? I dream things that never were and say, why not? Robert Francis Kennedy. His fight for equality and justice inspired a nation. And in 1968, Robert Kennedy's family and friends founded an organization dedicated to realizing his dream of a more just and peaceful world. For four decades, the RFK Center has been working on the cutting edge of social change with human rights activists around the world, people who are the Martin Luther Kings of their countries. Article 25 of the Universal Declaration of Human Rights recognizes the right to health care. Today, we are so happy to be here to announce Healthy Villages, a new program of the RFK Center where we're harnessing the capacity of cutting edge technology to bring health care to the neediest people on this earth, people in Kenya, in Haiti, in Mexico, and in the poorest places of the United States. Health care uh, services is not an obligation, it's a right for every single uh, individual on this earth. It's not only the right uh, to have access to health care, it's a right to have a safe environment. And so in terms of advancing this great technology, not to our own you know, country where we have limitations, but to correct the limitations here and to expand it and extend those technology services to other countries, it is a responsibility of every health world leader. Well, at all scripts, we've always taken the position that we want to do things that make a difference. So whether it's making a difference through our technology in healthcare or making a difference on a more global basis, Healthy Villages was an opportunity to really leverage the good things we were doing and expand them worldwide. We can, one by one, reach out to other countries and train these individuals about the access to technology. We have stepped forward a little bit further than where we were yesterday, and that's what Healthy Village is all about. We're so looking forward to working with everyone in this room to make our world more just and peaceful in the vision of Robert Kennedy. Yeah.